Well, hello and welcome. So, do I got any single wide pans out there? I hope so. This one is not just a single wide. It's a jumbo wide. In fact, that's what they call it. Not just your standard single wide. This one features three bedrooms, two bathrooms, just like most single wides. You actually have a separate dining room in this one. Yeah, this is an 18 foot wide single wide. The biggest you can get in the United States. Yeah, 1300 square foot for a single wide. Now, of course, I can't get down there to show you the very end, but you can see. So yeah, the largest single wide you can get on the market. Now you might be asking yourself, okay, that's as big as a lot of double wides in square footage. Where can I find this wonderful home? I am at uh, Clayton Homes in Waco, Texas. So check out the link down below. It'll take you back to this home on their website. Just wanna say thank you for clicking on the video. Oh, we got to get inside. There's a lot to see for a single wide. Trust me on that one. Y'all are going to want to stick around for this. So now we're inside. Tell me, if you did not know that this was a single wide, that you wouldn't be thinking that living room is coming out of a double wide. Look at the size of this living room. It is big. We've got eight and a half foot ceilings in here. So not only is the living room large, your ceiling is nice and tall. You got all recessed lighting all the way through. Now there is a fixture for your ceiling fan there. Now they do have an air conditioner running, so hopefully it's not too loud in here. But look at that. I mean, that's just, I'm in shock, honestly. I mean, I've never seen a single white this big. Now we're going to swing around. Look at the size of the island in this thing. Now granted, your sink is in the island. It is a two-part sink. Not to say two parts, but you know, you got dual sinks versus one large stainless steel sink. I bet you you could option in that stainless steel sink. I mean, there's plenty of room for it. You've got the stack of drawers right here. The black Frigidaire appliances in this package. Now this one has the vents in the floor. There is a new model coming out here shortly. It will be almost identical to this one. The vents will be in the ceiling. If you don't like the vents in the floor, but you want something like this, check out their website here in a couple months and you will see one that's coming up with the vents in the ceiling. We got the black hood here to match the appliances. So it kind of blends everything in. I like the color of the wall in the back area there. This kind of sets itself apart from all the rest of the black.
Okay, now remember I told you this had its own separate dining room. Okay, so that's master bedroom. That's the living room. That's the kitchen. Well, where in the heck is the dining room? Because it sure isn't going to go right there. go down the hall. Now I don't know if the camera does this justice, but this is not the normal width of a hallway in a single wide. I got elbows out and I'm not touching. So this is a, <laughs> a really wide hallway. Of course now we just passed the central heating and air unit there. Here is your dining room. Now granted, it's carpeted. That's an easy change when you option in the home yourself. Just take the carpet out, tell them you don't want carpet in there, you only want it in the bedrooms. They can do that for you. I mean, that's a good sized dining room. Easily fit four people at, a, at the round table there. Heck, you could even probably put you a, a rectangular table with no problem. Nice to see. I really like that somebody thought out of the box with this one. And of course that is one of your bedrooms, but we got to show you. They got a couch or a chair in the way here, but <laughs> here is your utility room. So you've got washer and dryer hookups, of course, your back door. There is your electrical panel. And then this, believe it or not, is the front bedroom. Now it's not as big as like a standard single wide, or I mean double wide bedroom would be, but this is a large front bedroom. Not only is it a large front bedroom, but how many front bedrooms have a closet that big in them? Yeah, that is a nice big closet to go with your Halfway decent sized front bedroom. I mean, it's, like I said, I can't say that it's large, but it's definitely much bigger than what you usually get. And then, door number two is your bathroom. Now your bathroom, you just got your standard size counter there with your cabinet underneath. Hello, Raiden. Just your basic, you know, two-piece shower tub combo there. Of course, you got your toilet. Now, the bathroom in the master bathroom is a nice big bathroom to go along with the great big bedroom that you get. And this is your back bedroom. Now this is a good sized bedroom. I venture to say square footage wise, this one is bigger than what most of your back bedrooms are in the single wise, even though it doesn't run the full width of the home because you have this giant walk-in closet. Yeah, a walk-in closet for your, for your kids' rooms in a single wide. Bet you never seen that before. So now we got to go check out other end of the home. So you thought it's already been good. I think it's really good down here. You have a little bit of a hallway to get into your master bedroom. But then it opens up into very large bedroom. Now, of course, there's a window there. So that tells you that you are where? At the very end of the home. Well, usually that's where the bathroom is. No window there, but that's the outside of the wall. So then where's the bathroom at in this one? Well, that long walkway that we came into, there's your bathroom.
a large closet. Now the only change I would make, I'd put the accordion style doors in here just so I could separate the closet out a little bit. But you got shelves on both ends of the closet. Another one right there. So you've got a nice big walk-in closet. You got the dual sinks. Now there's no drawers, but you've got lots of cabinet space down below. Great big vanity mirror, lights above each of your sinks. And you've got, of course, your toilet area. And then on the back side, you've got your shower tub combo. So that's not your standard size tub. That is a nice big wide tub. So I hope you all have enjoyed this jumbo wide, uh, single wide home. He said, this is the largest you can get in the United States, I believe. 18 foot wide. I don't think you can go any wider. This is 76 foot long, so I don't think you can go any longer than 80 foot. So yeah, we're talking basically the largest you can get. With that, I hope you all left me a comment. I got to get you some price information, but don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Hit the notification bell. That way you get notified when I upload videos. I will see you on the flip side. I'm back. <laughs> so we are in the jumbo wide. What did you think? I mean, this is like a large single wide. I can't believe it. I'm in shock at how big this is. I love the fact that somebody went out of the box on this one separate dining room you know the way they laid the bedrooms out back there you know lots to love with this if you are a single wide fan this is the one for you now granted it's not sheetrock i don't know how much that would cost to have sheetrock done on this i would check into it to see about sheetrock but the price on this one is like unbelievable starting price in january of 2023 at Clayton Homes in Waco, Texas, where this was just made right down the road, comes in at a hundred grand. Yep, so only a hundred thousand dollars for this 1300 square foot single wide. As shown, so set up, delivered, all that kind of stuff, they're talking hundred and ten thousand dollars with all the upgrades they've done to it, you know, that kind of stuff. Really good price. I mean, you can't beat it. Where else are you going to get a 1,300 square foot home for 110 grand? Anyway, keep in mind there could be other city, county fees, things like that. I can't account for everything, so this may or may not be the price that you pay. And I will see you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Have a good evening. Bye.